back to another video. Today's video is going to be a fall clothing haul for a toddler girl and a boy. He is almost five years old, but he wears a size six, seven. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Leslie. I would really love it if you consider subscribing. I create lifestyle content, motherhood content, healthy grocery hauls from Trader Joe's, Costco, and Whole Foods healthy easy recipes so if you enjoy healthy and easy recipes then this is the channel for you because i do share a lot of that you can also follow us over on instagram where i share a ton of plant content and a ton of food content so if any of these topics are of interest to you then definitely follow me over there let's be friends consider subscribing and sticking around and i'm actually refilming this video because i had my fan on and the noise was too much in the background so here I am shooting it the second time. So that's why you see this whole mess here because I've already showed you guys, but let's jump into the video. The first uh, thing that I'm going to show you, so we shopped at Old Navy, Zara, H&M, Target, and a couple of pieces from Walmart. I believe that, that those are the only ones. So let's jump into the video really quickly. Let me show you what I picked up for Sophia from Old Navy. Again, she is my three-year-old who's currently wearing size four to five T or at least those are the things we picked up for this skirt. Some of the stuff are from oldnavy.com and some we shopped at the store. So I'll share the prices for the ones that are at the store. If you do want to get the links to all of these items, I can definitely do that for you. Let me know in the comment section. I'll be sure to add the links to the description box. So I picked up this skirt for Sophia from Old Navy. Also picked up a pair of stockings, beige and gray. I'm ordering a couple things from Amazon that I'll probably insert somewhere on here. And they haven't arrived yet, but I'll insert that. Old Navy was having a 30% off, which is why we picked up more items. Sophia is actually in preschool for this year and all of next year, so she does not wear a uniform. Lucas, we purchased a little bit less for him because he does wear a uniform Monday through Thursday, and so he doesn't have that need for so much clothing. This uh, flannel for Sophia was only $10 at Old Navy. We also picked up this super plain sweater here for, let's see here, I don't know because it was from oldnavy.com. It is super hot right now because I have everything closed and I had to turn off my fan so that you guys didn't hear all the crazy noise in the background. So I will be taking water breaks. I also picked up this jacket for Sophia from Old Navy. Uh, this was $36.99 minus a 30% off. How cute is this? Also picked up for her this dino shirt for $5 at 30% off. This was a size 5T. Everything that I picked up is a size 4 or 5T. Also picked up this top to go under some of her dresses, overall dresses, or some of her little skirts at size 5T. And that's all for Sophia from Old Navy. I will also share what I picked up for Lucas from Old Navy. It was just a few pieces. This flannel for $10. I love this flannel, by the way. I'm loving the colors. Picked up this t-shirt for Lucas. This was very inexpensive. I wish I would have picked up a couple more. This was only $5. Just because the kids always stain them and they ruin them, especially at school or like at church when they go to their little class and they have markers. I picked up these pants for him. That's what I picked up from Old Navy. Oh, I forgot actually for Sophia. I did pick her up this set of two PJs. These she can probably use in the spring because it's a short sleeve top. And this set was only $10.50 for the two sets of pajamas. And then these are long sleeves, so she can actually wear it now. These are dinosaur, and I love the colors. These are just uh, too cute. Please do tell me in the comment section, where do you enjoy to shop for clothing for your kids? And what ages are your kids? I also find that it's really hard to find cute clothes for my son, for Lucas, because he's already like a boy size, so six and seven. But for Sophia, I can still find really cute stuff, but I'm worried that as she gets older, I'm gonna have the same problem that I'm having with Lucas, so we'll see. So from Target, I found a few things on sale, so they're not so much fall type clothing, but they were on sale. This skirt was only $4.50. How cute is this? She's gonna wear this through the spring and fall of next year, God willing. So $4.50 for this skirt. These shorts, she's probably going to wear until way next year. Uh, these were also, I think, $3. So I had to pick them up. Really nice material. 
These were on sale for four or five dollars as well. So also for the spring. These are all Target, by the way. And this top on sale for five dollars. So I had to pick that up. Super cute. I picked up these little biker shorts for her, like to wear under her dresses. Uh, that's really important for us. We want to make sure she's not showing her chonies. And I picked up this little top here for, I believe, $7 at Target. It's a waffle material. I really like uh, Target's waffle material for either the um, long sleeves for boys, which actually for toddler boys, they don't have them for boys, but for toddler boys, please Target, make them for boys. And then this really cute dress as well. This is pumpkin patch worthy. So we'll see what she wears for the pumpkin patch. I mean, I'm intrigued. Have you guys made it to the pumpkin patch or not yet? Is it too early? Is it too, too late? I guess it all depends of where you live right here in LA. It's still so hot. Let's move on to H&M. So H&M also for Sophia. Like I said, I picked up a lot more things for Sophia than I did for Lucas because for Lucas, I mainly shop at Zara. I find that that's the only place where I can find things that I like for him. So here is H&M. So I picked up this top with the little ruffles here. This was a uh, buy two, get one free, but I only ended up picking up one. We were with the kids in a hurry. The kids were cranky and yeah, it's just much easier to buy online. But this I picked up at the store. Let's see if it gives me the price. It was $9.99, a, uh, a little steep, I wanna say. Okay, this I'm really excited about. I picked up from the store, but this is an online only item and this is part of their 100% organic cotton collection. Uh, when you pick it up at the store is because somebody else returned it at the store and it's usually 50% off. So that's one of my favorite things to do at H&M is go through their sale rack because that's where I find these organic cotton items for half the price. So it happened to be Sophia size. Of course, they only had one and I picked it up. This is going to be more for either right now and then the spring because it's really light material, but it's that material that we really love and that we really enjoy her wearing. It's really, it feels really good on the skin. It comes with this little top. Super cute. So another thing I found that I had seen online and I was about to purchase online for like $30 or I'm sorry, $40 and I'm glad I didn't is this set for Sophia. So it's a uh, sweats and uh, sweatpants and sweatshirt. And this was only $19.99 for both pieces, 100% organic cotton. And for me, quality is really important, but unfortunately that also comes at a certain price that I'm not willing to, you know, pay at this point because the kids are going to grow out of it. And then what happens? I end up donating or giving away their clothes. So for that reason, I try not to spend so much money on their clothes. And I only have two major hauls for them during the year, usually in the spring, early spring, so that it can carry them to summer and then in the early fall so that it can be for fall and winter. And that's about it. During the year, we buy little things here and there if they really need them. But usually we do two big hauls and that's, that's that. I mean, we have to do it because they're growing. These I bought on sale. These are just like regular sweatpants, neutral. Leopard is a neutral, $5 for Sophia. And that's about all I picked up from H&M. I didn't find anything for Lucas there. Quickly here from Target, I'm sorry, from Walmart, I found these pants. Uh, this is an easy, easy peasy brand. It's also like a, a made with recycled polyester. So this is not cotton, but it's recycled polyester. It's supposed to be good for the earth. $12.98. So I thought these would be really good for her when she goes to school. It's kind of chilly in the mornings. I've also picked up this top. I'm very excited about this top because she can get a lot of wear from it. And this one is from... Also the Easy PC brand, but I'm not sure what the material is. Let's see. Oh, this is 100% cotton. This is the type of material I like. Also 100% cotton is the, the, the pants that go with that shirt. These were $9.98 for each piece. Now this dress, I really, really love because she can wear with stockings and boots. Super cute. Had a tag of $13.99 or $15. I picked it up. I was willing to pay for that price. 
but when I scanned it, it said $1.90. I checked the tag to make sure it belonged to the dress and it was the right tag. So this was only $1.90 and I'm so excited because this is the best deal yet that I picked up. All right, so that's from Walmart. Actually, I forgot to show you guys that from Tygen, from their sale rack, I picked up these swimming trunks for Lucas for next year. These are a size seven, so he can totally wear these next year. All we have left is Zara. So Zara, I ordered some stuff online and I purchased some stuff in the store. What I purchased in the store was this sweater for Sophia. Super cute. This is going to be a great addition for her dresses, for her skirts, for the fall. Very expensive and I wasn't happy about the price, especially for the quality, but what are you going to do? Tell me about these boots. I saw them. I love them. They were $40. I picked them up and then I instantly regretted it once I was home because the material is really bad material. I don't know if she will actually be able to wear these for two years because the quality seems pretty low and they were all, they were $40. I don't know if I should return them and then spend a little bit more and buy her a good quality boot. I don't know. What should I do? Tell me in the comment section. Online, this was from Zara Online. It's the same exact sweater, just different color for Sophia. How cute is this going to be with this skirt, you guys? Oh my God, you guys, I cannot wait for her to wear this, like with this sweater, like half tucked in and her little boots and her stockings, oh, just adorable. But only if LA gave us cooler weather. Last but not least, Lucas's clothes from Zara. So it's going to be a bunch of stuff. Like I said, he goes to school and wears a uniform Monday through Thursday. Uh, so he's not like in dire need of clothes, but Sophia definitely was. So we got him a few sweatpants. So I picked him up these olive green sweatpants for $17.90. These are a size A. Lucas is pretty tall, so he does need uh, to wear like a couple sizes up. These are also a size 8. These are very nice material. I actually really like these. These were also $17.90. Has a little bit of a print there. I also picked up these pants. I'm a little worried. I have to check. I am a little worried that they might be a little short for him. Size 8. There's a little bit of construction going on outside. So you might hear that in the background. So I apologize. All right, these here, they were a little pricey, I guess, because they have a little bit more detail. These were $30, but these were, again, $30. These are a size eight as well. These are pretty long, so I think he'll be fine with these. In a size, I'm um, sorry, in a color navy blue, I picked up these other sweatpants, and these are mainly for him to wear to school. So this would be like his uniform. Pan. Another thing I picked up for Lucas are these uh, sweaters. I picked up uh, three in total. This green one in a size 10. So right now the oversized look is very, very in. So I think that he can get away with hopefully using these for two years because I don't know guys, $25.90 for the material. I think it's a little pricey. This is a little bit of a nicer feel and material. These are a size nine, also for Lucas, nine in color black. This is a hoodie and it feels a little bit nicer. The material feels a little stretchier, a little bit comfier. Lastly, for sweaters, this also feels really, really nice. And this is a sweater for a sweatshirt for Lucas in a size nine as well. I also picked up this t-shirt for Lucas, uh, just like a taupe color. These were probably anywhere between $9.99 and $12.99. Picked them up a long sleeve. I don't love the material, but it doesn't feel very good. But I thought, you know, better for him to get some long sleeves. But this a striped shirt for Lucas. And that's going to be it, guys, for the haul. Thank you so much for watching. These are Lucas's um, Sarah tops. These are Lucas's Sarah sweatpants. Sophia's Zara sweaters and boots. Just doing a little recap. Lucas's Old Navy tops and pants. Sophia's Walmart pants set and dress. Sophia's 
H&M haul, Sophia's Target haul, you're falling apart, Old Navy. And that's about it, guys. If you have any questions about any of these items and prices, you can let me know. We'll definitely try to link them for you. If you do want the links, then let me know so that I can go back and look for all of these items and link them. But please, please let me know in the comment section so that if, if I know that you do want the links, then I will be sure to put them in the description box. If you have any questions, leave them down below. I hope that you enjoyed today's haul and I'll see you on the next one. If you watch till the end, please leave me an emoji of a mom with a boy and a girl so I know who you are. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye.